Hello everybody, this is Samurai Jake. And this is Noobs. And uh, we're uh, gonna show you the new house. No, I, wait a minute. All right, I think we got crisis. that backwards. Identity crisis. Oh no! Uh, uh, we're gonna show them the house in a bit. I wanna make my stuff first. Okay. Maybe identify we... as Samurai Jake. What? I said maybe identify as Samurai Jake. Yeah. No. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Like, maybe I'm you. No. Uh, I think we've had this discussion before, actually. Maybe I'm just part of your No, 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 so no. <laughs> you made me get silver ingots. Thank you. Okay. Um, so, Samurai Jake has built onto the house some. And uh, he's made some dwarven uh, bolts. Whoa. How much more is that? That That's looks not, fancy. Uh, yeah, it looks fancy. It doesn't do as much as your orcish one, though. No, no, it doesn't. But it it is pretty cool. It still looks cool, pretty cool. So wait a minute. Dwarven bow is not in the uh, real game, right? So this is just made up of what? This is, dwarven what? crossbow is not in the real game. Yeah. This is something for your mods. Yeah. A dwarven regular bow is, however. Yeah, yeah, definitely, but crossbow. I just want to see, like, the, yeah. the Orcish crossbow, it's, like, made up of, like, Orcish weapons. I need leather so strips I was trying to see if there was it. Uh, yep, leather strips is all I need. Alrighty, leather strips. But, uh, yeah, we built the trophy room and the uh, bedroom. Yep. We'll show you what it looks like on the inside, since I'm already on the inside, and then we'll go to the outside. Oh, I can make a lot of stuff now, but Dwarven Shield. <coughs> what happened to Dwarven Boots? Oh, we need to still get for those two. Oh, yeah. Back and out in Dwarven. Might as well. Yep. It's awesome. You can upgrade your Dwarven too. Yep. Which I'm going to do now. Yeah, that's nice. 13 different than... I think it's 13 higher than your last one now if you do that. Or that's just that's 10, 10 higher. Well, I mean, but that's... That, the dwarven armor is definitely better to craft first. It gives you the most. Yeah. But what? That gives you ten. And that, that gives you five. But oh. I'm saying it's a total of thirteen better than your other shield. Oh right. Well, this is still better than my other shield. Yeah, by eight, and then yeah. the plus five from. Yeah. But I think I'll do, yeah, this do that one, first. That, yeah. That's what you should do first. Yeah. Oh, that, that was less than your Dwarven, wasn't it? Yep. Well, well, that's okay. It is okay. I am now... Uber. 632 armor rating. That's pretty good. Mm-hmm. Let's take a look at you. Well, first, I want to go ahead and get rid of these. I can't break down my shield. Okay, well, that's so, all I... Oh, no! You know... My shield served me well. It deserves to be put on a mannequin. Yep. I probably could have put the boots on there, too, but whatever. I need the steel. The uh, dwarven armor I never really thought looked great. Um, the helmet I kind of liked, but... I don't know, it just looks really, really? weird. But the... Um, I feel like it would look a lot better on a dwarf-sized character for some reason, except that there are none. Like, I don't know. It doesn't look bad, but like, especially like the boots look all weird and stocky, and they look like UGG boots. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. 
Shield always looked pretty good, I thought. Yeah, the shield looked pretty awesome. Sweet. Well, and then your orcish helmet. Just yep. because you want to be different. Yep. I'm the Dragonborn. Well, sort of. Alright. Proceed. Here's oh, the tour. Oh, man. Alright. Trophy room. Look at all these trophy trophies. Oh. I mean, it's not done yet. I need to actually put the stands it'll, on it, there. It'll get better. <laughs> it'll get better. Bedrooms. Yeah, oh, no beds. And you sleep on the floor, everybody. <laughs> Man, it's the house is lame. And the armory. And there's nothing in here either because I haven't made it yet. But it's going to be, the walls are going to be lined this with mannequins and stuff. This is a great stuff. empty house. Well, considering that this <laughs> is the main hall and, like, there's nothing in here either. Yeah. It is pretty dismal, though. I need to go out and get some goat horns to get some sconces. Light. Yeah, sconces, yeah. Yep. And now I'll show you what it looks like on the outside. It looks much better on the outside. Because there's, like, nothing there. Anyway. But, for those of you that have played this before, it will look pretty empty on the outside, too. Because, again, I just got done building it last episode. Yeah, we'll have to start filling it up with stuff. Oh, look, a sword I'm never going to use. <laughs> yeah, why is that? Evil sword? Daedric sword. Yeah. It's a life drinker. Nice. And it gets stronger from the blood of deceit. So, you kill your friends, it gets stronger. How's that deceit? Like, that's just douchebaggery. Well, that's what it says. It feeds off the blood of the... It feeds off the blood of deceit. But this is basically the balcony of the armory. The bedroom will look much like this, except once it's furnished, it'll look a little different. And that's basically our house now. So you got the entryway, the, ma the main manse, the armory, the bedroom on the other side, and that big thing on the end there is the, uh, I thought I saw red dots. And the uh, big thing on the back is the trophy room that we have no ability to walk on yet. What is that? What is what? That light down there. Oh, that's where a necromancer is. Oh, yeah, right. You know what? Come here, faithful steed. Lunamoth. Uh, so quick save it first? Hmm. Huh? Are you gonna quick save it before you go fight this necromancer? Uh, yeah. Okay. I'm making sure. But, you know, when you fight mages, you're walking on runes and stuff. What was that? Oh, bones or something, maybe. Uh, yeah. I'll have to check that in a minute. This is not the light we saw. It is not. Well, go back up to your house. No, no, no. Oh, did I go too far down? There is a necromancer over here, last time I remember. There's... What was that? Looks like Imperials. Yeah. Chopping wood. Why are they so up at arms? against you. Unless they're just bandits in Imperial Garb again. 
Oh, the bandits. But they're not trying to kill me, so. That was interesting. Okie dokie. That was a little disorientating. This looks happy. Uh. They're dead. Just saying. Worshipper. Oh, Talish Worship. I feel better already. Uh, what killed these people? Imperials? I don't know. Thalmor. Huh. Oh. Wait, Melvin Sword does better than that? Well, let's see. I don't know if it is. Deft hands. Well. Okay. Why not? Thumb more orders. Because you're a douche. In response to your report dated 22nd Morning Star 401, your request for an expedition force is hereby denied. Sanyan. This is the seventh report you have filed this month, and not one of your leads, not one, has returned so, so much as a shred of evidence that a Talos shrine exists in the Lake uh, Ilanalta region. No prisoners, no documents, nothing. Our forces are, are stretched thin enough as it is, and I have better missions, better agents to assign them to. If you feel so sure in your informant, er, in your informant investigate this yourself. Come back with proof or not at all. By my hand and seal. Ellen win. <laughs> Ellen win. Hmm. Well, um, apparently he found the Tylo Shrine, but uh, they killed him too. Yep. Yep. These guys are armed. Well, not her. He was. Bury them. I shall bury them. After picking their pockets. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean... They don't need gold where they're going. They don't. Would I bury a Thalmar? I don't know. You turn her into a tombstone. I guess the question is answered by would you loot a corpse? <laughs> and you're like, not normally, but on these guys I sure would. So, uh, you know, feed them to the wolves. They need some meat. Oh yeah, find out if that uh, Elven Sword oh, is right. any good. Nope. So it, it's seven, but it's, so swords swing faster. Yep. So it's not as good as your... Skyforge. Skyforge steel by like a little bit, but it swings faster, so technically it'd be about the same. Hmm. But hmm. axes also penetrate a little bit of armor. So it's like, swords are supposed to be for like uh, non-armored folks, like mages. You just go up there yeah. and swing really fast and do max damage each hit. And, you know, axes are kind of in the middle of the road. And then maces are for heavy armor wielders. They swing yep. the slowest, but when they hit, they ignore some armor. Well. Uh, it's unfortunate. Leave. Yes, it is. But I have done my God's work. Oh, 
Oh yeah, it's the necromancer. Go back to your place and then lead from there. Whoa! What? Oh, a big wolf? Uh, yeah, there's like five wolves there. Well, quick save and massacre some wolves. <laughs> well, no, because that's also where the bandits are. So I'm gonna leave them there. Bandits versus wolf pack. We'll see how that works. However, that necromancer, where is it? I'm very sure that there is a necromancer. Oh, there it is. Okay. Alright then. Did we already kill him? Did we? Search around. Is there a book on there I saw? There is a book. Potentate. Residues shade through the door. You can open the door, sure, you're perfectly safe. No one wants to kill you. Hmm. Well, I don't know. I... suppose we already did. Poor rabbit. Hmm. Well, I guess we don't need to worry about a uh, necromancer at our door. Okay, lots of bats coming from the ground. You know what? To do something in this video, I'm gonna go kill the wolves and then the bandits. I have I have really no better quest to do right now. Wait a minute. Quest. There was Nettlebane and then there was something else. Oh, guess not. Finding. Sweet. This is what I wanted. Up oh, there. Eh, the wolves didn't. I mean, the wolves lasted about as much as I thought they would. Huh? <laughs> the wolves did about as good of a job as I thought they would. Yep. Back off, back off. To the left. To the mm. left. Back off. That's close enough. <laughs> yeah. Just couldn't back resist. Mm. Well, they are bandits. And they are near my home. How 
No, you'll try. Let's see. Oh no. Well, I don't like yeah, that. Pass him by again, you'll get him. Well, I'm totally ignoring these wolves. Count out that coin. <laughs> what is that? Treasure map. Oh. Interesting. Yes, very. He just like. I just like lean over. Just walk up. Yeah. And pow. <laughs> right to the temple. Like, alright. Alright, Wolfie. Wanna tangle? Nope. Just kidding. That's what I thought. What do we got? Get that one. Get that one. Nope. 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 Nice. I've noticed that whenever I get satchels at the bandit places, they always contain gold and lock picking tool or lock picks yeah night falls on sentinel hmm. oh somebody had black mage robes There's quite a few wolves. Yeah, definitely. Well, now we're done clearing out your uh, area around your house. Yep. My home is now safe. Uh, but I can't leave yet. I have one more service to perform. Yes. Really, Wolf? I'll let you go. Whatever. Yeah. Where they lay. Can you bury the wolves? I will bury one. Just to see. Huh. Here lies wolf. wolf. Oh, wolf. I miss you, wolf. <laughs> you were such a good boy. All right. Well, where shall we be off to? Well, I could always go back to Markarth and get Bandit Run, but I kind of want to save that to when I need gold. Yeah. 
So. Kill a moose. Hmm. <laughs> no, you don't need to. Um. Whoa. Kind of at a loss now. Yeah, I guess we'll have to figure that out. We might just have to, uh. You know. Yeah. Go around looking for quests and strange places. I, I guess find there's always a quest to find that guy. in strange places. What? There's a quest to find that guy that we never finished. Well, yeah, because it doesn't give me any location really to search. Yeah, but, I mean, it, it does. It tells you that it's in the crossing, uh, or the, the... Oh, what we got here? Hunter? Yeah. Yep. The same yeah. one that you scared last time by running him over. And he's like, oh my gosh. Yeah. Hey, there's a barrel. North Shriekwind. Do you, uh, think you are up to taking a barrel? Truthfully, I... And what reason would you have to go in there? I don't really have a reason other than to explore. Yeah. It's kind of like why we need quests. Your character's really more of a loyal servant, doing quest kind of guy. Not really like, you know, Tomb Raider type of guy. Yeah. Where's... Man, I'm all over the place. Alright, well, yeah, we'll kind of cut it. We'll cut it here. We always start from home. Yeah. So, yeah, I guess we'll just cut it here and pick it up when we figure out what to do. All right. Well, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.